Hi everyone, thank you so much for stopping by. Today I'll be doing a book review and this is entitled Punk 57. This is written by Penelope Douglas and um, I'm going to give you information from Goodreads and then we're going to go from there. So this is rated 3.90 out of 5 stars and it says we were perfect together until we met Misha. I can't help but smile at the words in her letter. She misses me. In fifth grade, my teacher set, set us up with, pe uh, with pen pals from different schools thinking it was a girl with a name like Misha. The other teacher paired me up with her student, Ryan. My teacher believed Ryan was a boy like me. Agreed. It didn't take long for us to figure out the mistake, and in no time at all, we were arguing about everything. The best takeout pizza, Andrew versus iPhone, whether or not Eminem is the greatest rapper ever, and that was the start for the next seven years. It was us. Her letters are always on black paper with silver writing. Sometimes there's one week or three in a day. But I need them. She's the only one who keeps me on keeps me on track, talks me down, and accepts everything I am. We only had three rules. No social media, no phone numbers, no pictures. We had a good thing going. Why ruin it? Until I run across a photo of a girl online named Ryan. Loves Gallo's Pizza and worships her iPhone. What are the chances? Um, I need to meet her. I just don't expect to hate what I find. Ryan. He hasn't written in three months. Something's wrong. Did he die? Get arrested? Knowing Misha, neither would be a stretch. Without him around, I'm going crazy. I need to know someone is listening. It's my own fault. I should I should have gotten his number or picture or something. He could be gone forever or right under my nose and I wouldn't even know it. So um, these genres belong to would be romance, new adult contemporary, young adult contemporary romance, high school fiction, adult music, dark. And this was first published back in October 18, 2016. This is the second book that I've um, that I've read from Penelope Douglas. Um, I was really surprised with this one, but this was very highly suggested, and I took a chance on it, and I'm glad that I did. I'm surprised that the rating is below four because this was really um, this was really really good. So basically, they started off when they were kids of like. I think elementary grade like primary school um they were getting pen pals and um not a ton of spoilers but they're they're in the same state they're 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 it's not like they're pen pals from like different states and different parts of the world it's not like that they're actually in the same state they're actually not very far away from each other but they've never really met and all of a sudden um ryan has a heard anything from Misha for like months and she got really worried about that and what will happen in the story is that in the very beginning it shows Misha um just a little bit of sliver of his life and after that it shows Ryan's life and um and who she really is and and um Anyway, um, I, I don't want to do any spoilers, but who she really is, and um, there were some parts in here that were like really, really hard because um, Misha was really kind of a difficult character for me to like, but this was all explained afterwards. Um, so I really don't want to do a ton of spoilers, but there yeah there was a part of this that i really didn't like misha and i also didn't like ryan at the same time and um i mean they were explained with the journey of the story it was just like there was a lot of like um just strange behavior um a lot of secret stuff and that's all i'm gonna say if i say anything more it's gonna be spoilers so i apologize um, I'm gonna zip this up <laughs> because I don't want to possibly do a spoiler. Um, I would rate this actually a five out of five stars and a two thumbs up. Really, really good. It got me very invested, very interested, hard to put down type of book. So if you're interested in this, and this is also a young adult, which is a little kind of iffy because there are some, um, there are some romantic scenes in here and slightly graphic so that always kind of like worries me when it's when it's like um something that when it's like something like that in high school still high school age 
that still kind of um, worries me a little bit. But yeah, that's it. That's it. I'm not going to say anything else more. Um, if you guys have other suggestions on books that I will probably enjoy because I really do enjoy this one, let me know down in the comment section below. If you want to discuss about this book, you anything about this book, let me know down in the comment section below. Again, suggestions. Um, highly accepting that because I'm always open to getting acquiring more books. I'm also currently trying to grow more of my collection in the mystery thriller, thriller mystery, psychological thriller, suspense. Um, mystery, suspense, suspense, mystery, whatever the subgenre or genre it would belong to, that kind of scope. I'm really, really, um, I'm trying to grow my collection in that one because I do have like a ton of like romance, but I did enjoy this one. So if there are any other ones that are kind of similar to this one, um, let me know. It doesn't have to be Penelope Douglas because I already know who she is. It could be a different author or if you, if there are other Penelope Douglas that you believe it's really, really good, and you believe that I should probably jump it up on the level of when I should read it, let me know as well. Thank you, everyone, for the love and support. Stay happy, stay smiling, stay healthy, and I'll see you again next time. Bye.